Oh, it is different to draw with this one though. It is very different. We're not good at drawing quickly. This pen is so brittle. Ooh, I'm not getting the proportions right. Ah, that's not where your, that's not where your body should go. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, that's cute. Oh. Hey! Oh, there we go. <laughs> ah! Oh, be careful! It doesn't wash out. Okay. Four, three, two, one. Stop! Ta -da! Ta -da! This is a reoccurring rabbit element on the magical girl's clothes and hair. I didn't have time to do a first draft and get the balance right. This was um, a really bad attempt at a little character that I've been drawing for a while and not known, not known, not known to what, what to do with. It's the zombie, zombie puta. This was my attempt to draw a zombie pig. Okay, is that going to be included in your story, possibly? Possibly. This is my robot. I would like to have some kind of robotic android as a character or maybe as a theme. Don't know. So for this one, I am actually trying to uh, do her eyes. Oh, this is horrible. This is so hard to draw fast with. Ah, I want to get this right though. I can see you switching the paper around in different directions. It's pretty cool. Can't do it. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Help. Oh, it's like a dagger. Ah, that's good enough. Oh. <laughs> I'm running out of ink. No ink. It's fine. No. We run out of time as well. <laughs> We're running out of ink and time. The idea is that in her eyes, there's also a little bunny in her eyes, character-wise. Nice detail! Yay! This is a sword design that, that I've also been messing with for a long time, and maybe it might show up in the, in the comic. It's a car. There might be a car chase. I thought it'd be quite cool to have cars racing around, because I'm a fan of gunsmith cats. Hang on a minute, what's that? Oh wow. Oh, that was a mistake. It's gonna be a spoon. Mm. The full blown character design. <laughs> is it castle on the sound? <laughs> it is. Now I'm just gonna go for decorations. Done. Okay. Ah! ah. <gasps> okay! Since it's all about sweets and so on, there is this sweet spoon that she always has with her, like a teaspoon. And she can use for fighting. Huge. It's pretty huge. <laughs> so it's, a, it's my original thought of weapon. It's a very, very slow and painful death. There probably would be wolves somewhere in my comic. Possibly vampires or some other gothic element of some sort, maybe. It is a castle in the sky. I don't know if there's gonna be a castle in the sky, but there will be something floating in a place that it's not supposed to be. There might be a castle on the ground. There, may, there, be, there, there will be clouds in the sky. This is all for us to prepare as for our manga project. <laughs> I'm really nervous now. <laughs> I'm definitely, definitely not using this pen. Yeah. It was hard. You learned something. <laughs> I think the thinner it gets, the harder it is actually to use. Yeah, you have to be very gentle. <laughs> But this starter kit is pretty good because it has three different pen tips and also toner and three papers. So. Yeah, all you need is ink. I had fun. Did you have yes, fun? Yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, we are going to continue our Doki Doki manga project. So stay tuned for this on Doki Doki Drawing. And up on today. Catch you soon. Bye. Don't forget to click the playlist. Take the part of the screen. Our idea is to have a manga and start it from scratch to actually publishing it. So I've been working professionally as an artist in Japan for about three or four years. For that, I studied in a manga school for about two years. Right. This is like a replica of an old famous pencil that apparently famous people used to use. It's not actually <laughs> that much better than a normal pencil.